Hello YouTube, this is another video review from uh, Super Apple Forever, and this really isn't a review, um, it's a gameplay video of me playing a Tomb Raider 3, the demo, on a old, um, uh, Macintosh PowerBook G3 Wall Street, yeah, there you can see the old Apple, really looks good on this old LCD screen, sorry about the reflection right there, it really doesn't look as bright on, as, when I'm looking at it as it does on camera so let me turn it on. Okay, so let's play the game. I'm really probably not gonna be able to play this very well because um I am doing it with one hand so it may not look so good. It runs fairly well on here. It doesn't look the best but I mean but it runs pretty good. If you get like maybe a newer um power book that you really couldn't do much with if you upgraded it to Mac OS 10 and just put it left Mac OS 9 on it you could probably get a little bit better performance but this is the uh, original uh, Mac, uh, power book G3 so I'm really not going to get that good of a performance off of it um, maybe if I turn the settings down but this is a you look scared I mean you it's this is good to play you know, play some, there's a lot of good old games for Mac OS 9. This, I don't know what this is going to do. Yeah, I'm probably, probably stuck in there. Yeah, so I don't know how to jump on here. So, um, so I guess that's about it. So this is just a quick video of me playing Tomb Raider on a old Ma PowerBook G3 Wall Street with a 300 megahertz processor. It's funny though, my iPhone that I'm recording this on right now has a 600 megahertz processor. And it's, look at how tiny it is. And then here's this big thick uh, laptop that has 300 megahertz. So it shows really how far we've gone. So thanks for watching the video. If you have any questions about Mac OS 9 or, or any games that are available on it or anything like that, I'll try to find the answers. Um, if you know anything about Mac OS 9 that you think it would be interesting to people, put it in the comments. If you have any questions, you can either put them in the comments or send me a message, a private message. I don't really care either one. So uh, thanks for watching the video and please subscribe and like. Thank you.